I need some lotion nah, cause mama's hands were ashy. Girl. You gotta make sure that more should get between them. The hands, girl. But yeah, we, let's get into the video. Said I assume you didn't mean it like that. Oh, and quick note, if y'all wanna review on this hair, let me know. Um, or yeah, if y'all want to view on this hair, let me go ahead, let me know now, you know, do what I got to do. Um, so yeah, let's start the story. So we went to school, we went to middle school and high school together. Um, I went to Kip middle school and Kip high school, right? Um, that school I went to, we met and, now I knew him in middle school, but I didn't really see him like that in middle school, um, until the eighth grade year where I was showing this girl around. Our first interaction was I was showing this girl around and he was him and some boys on the court. And this, and this is the time where I was identifying as um, a gay male. And he saw me on, he just, he saw me and he started to pants me, right? He pants me and at the time, I didn't really wasn't, I mean, I was like mad, but I wasn't like, Bitch, fuck y'all. I was ready to fight, right? Cool. So, and that's pretty much how we know each other. Um, he pants me, and that's how he really got on my radar. I was like, what the fuck you pants me for? Like, that kind of, like, threw me the fuck off. So, I was just like, what the fuck? But so, anyway. So, yeah. So, that's how we met. That's how we got to know each other, right? And that's how I got on my radar for anything else in the world, right? So, that's eighth grade year going into high school year. High school year, um, I had... High school year, I had um, in ninth grade when first started in ninth grade. He wasn't. He, I mean, he was on my radar, but he was like on my radar because I had his crush on this other boy um, named Dennis, and it was girl. It was name was Dennis. I think his name was Dennis. We called him Shark Tooth Bitch because he was so pretty and cute, but he had shark teeth, girl. <laughs> and that's the key in itself. Like the nigga was fine, but he had these fucking shark teeth. And I can say it now because again, I stopped liking him. We cool people, stuff like that. So if anybody from high school see this and they, they want to send it to him, be my guest. I it's 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 really it's really on you know innocent girl. We all grown at this point now, but whatever. So I had a crush on him. So all my focus on him, girl. Me and my best friends, bitch. I used to key about Dennis. So I didn't think about um, I didn't think about oh boy, right? So we're gonna jump into when I start thinking about him. So. This was a time where kick was really, really big, right? And this was summer going, now when first I met around, this was summer going into 10th, ninth grade summer going to 10th grade right here. And yeah, so kick was really big back then. If you had a kick girl, you know what I'm talking about, bitch. Kick was the shit, bitch. You had all the hoes, bitch. Kids was wild on kick. I don't know. Kids was just wild on kick, okay? If you had a kick girl, you don't kick. Kick was just wild and bitch. So I had got his kick from somebody and I was like, yo, how am I gonna make this? You know, how, how am I gonna do this thing? Now mind you, I have had sex before, be, even before that. So I, I'm not new to this girl at this point, I'm true to this. I'm trying to see how, how I'm gonna get how I'm gonna get the dick, right? But I'm still kinda like I'm still, well I'm not new to this, I'm true to this, but at the same time I'm still kinda new, right? So because I've had like some sexual encounters, girl. But anyway. Um, but I need, I just sucked some dick, girl. I, I just really just sucked some dick. I didn't really do nothing crazy. But, um, but yeah. So anyway, so he, um, so I texted him on kick. I was like, hey, this is so-and-so. And then I said, nah, I thought I was slick, girl. I thought I was a slick bitch. So I said, oh, this is so-and-so. But then I said, oh, sorry, that was not for you, right? And that's why I said not for you. And then he texted back, which I was thinking he was going to text it back, but I left it there. I was like, whatever, like that. But he texted me back. He was like, oh, you cool, da 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 um, whatever, like that. He said, when to come over. Now, when he said he want to come over, bitch, I got kicked. Because at first, I was like, bitch, I know he was into me. I know he got down like that. You know, he's on. I know he's on DL. I know, the, I know the language back then. But I know he get down like that behind the scenes. Like, I was just like, girl, I was fangirling, right? Because he was a piece of trade. I was like, bitch, you know, I got this manly ass man trying to fuck me. You know what I'm saying? And even back then, I was heavier set. So, you know, it's it's just a lot of, bitch, somebody want to. You know, it's, it's, it's a lot of, it's a whole lot, a whole lot, right? So, I said, cool, bitch. 
I went in that hole, I washed myself off, and I went to his house. So, sorry, sorry, I'm getting my head of myself. So, he said, cool, um, you wanna come to my house? I said, cool, where you live at? He said, oh, I live right here, bitch. And he, the nigga was down the motherfucking street, right? Now, my trans girls, my femme gay boys, my gay boys, my butch queens, whatever, whatever you wanna say, do not allow a nigga to determine how you move, bitch. And by that, I mean, don't fucking go walking, driving, nothing like that. If you are getting penetrated, bitch, you he needs to, he needs to do the driving and the walking, bitch. Don't ever, and I mean that. Don't ever go to nigga house to fuck him, bitch. Stupid. Don't do it again. I would never do it again, bitch. Niggas gotta come see me, hoe. And that's just that. And if, 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 if you don't want to, bro, that's it. And that's a rap world. That's it on that. No shade. You know what I'm saying? So anyway. So I walked to his house and he was down the street. I said, cool, whatever like that, but I'll be like, give me like 20 minutes. I'll be there in a sec. He said, cool. So I got right in the bathroom, clean myself up, you know, get, get my life together, girl. Get my life in the bathroom, girl. You know, playing some music, um, you know, just girl, get, get into the things, all the things I need to get into, what things I need to get into, right? So I finally leave the house, said, hey, my grandmother, I'm just going for a walk. Girl, <laughs> I was, I was, I was a fast ass kid. I'm going, but even then, I used to like walk and run anyway. So she was like, you know, it wasn't nothing out the norm. I was like, hey, I'm going for what she said. Okay, cool, whatever. Like that. You say, be back. I said, cool. So I started my journey, girl, giving Dora and Boops tease, bitch. So I went to his house and I finally got there. And you know, at this point, I'm nervous. He texted me, like, where you at? What you doing? I said, I'm here on down the street. Like, what's up? What's up? What's up? He said, cool. He said, just walk in the door, right? So I came in. So it's the house is set up like a screen door and then it's a door. So I'm like, cause and bitch, I, I couldn't see because I have my glasses on. I have my glasses or contacts in. So I was just like, I can't see shit. But anyway, I saw a screen door and then he was right there. He said, hey, what's up? Come in. Well, it, it was open. And then it was him saying right there, bitch looking fine as ever. But I ain't gonna lie to you. Now, this nigga ain't fine no more to me. But bitch, back then he was so fine. And uh, I said, ooh, bitch, yes, fucking man. So I, um, he was standing right there. He said, "Yo, what's up?" He said, "Go in the room." I said, "Okay, cool." Now the key was he, he was watching his little brother, so you know, and his little brother. So it was like, you know, the kids say shit like, "Who the fuck is this bitch?" You know what I'm saying? So, um, so he was trying to hold his brother in this other room, which is so funny, bitch. He locked his brother in a room hall while I sk skittled out of my ass to the goddamn um, room. And the way is, and the way the room was set, the way it's all set up, you would walk in, make a strong right. And then make a left in Ness's room right there by the um right there by by the I'm sorry, right there by the the, the house. It's like the room in front of the house. It's like then his 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 room, wait. So I turned that corner in his room, girl, it's front of the house. I'm like that cool. He locked the door. I guess he checked on his brother a little more. I was in there for a little bit. He locked the door. We I came in. Uh, and that was it, right? So I sat on the bed and I'm just like you know, you know, you know how people do. I didn't have no hair, but I'm just like, so what's up? And he like, what's up? I'm like, what's up? And he like, what's up? That little childish ass gang bitch, but whatever. What's up? What's up? What's up? You know, we just doing all that for like at least a cute two minutes, right? And then I said, bitch, I got time for this, so I decided to take um to take that route, bitch, and I start going off, right? I'm doing girl <laughs> double hand back throw combo 300 girl i'm going in on that right and mind you daddy i kid you not biggest brush that daddy was big and thick so it was like mm, okay so i'm you know i'm still doing that bitch i'm trying to do it all bitch i'm trying to I mean, like, I'm I'm going in. Your girl is, if I see a bitch going in, I'm going in. And I, I ain't gonna talk about it no more, bitch. I'm just going in. His eyes went back, he was like that. I said, cool, all right, that's, so I'm doing a good job, right? So after that, I decided to, you know, I said, move on to bed, you know, still going, still going. He said, cool, he said, let me, why am I, bitch, let me fuck. Cause a bitch, I ain't getting sensitive. Yeah, I said, let me fuck. So he's, so sorry, that's what he said. He said, let me fuck. I said, cool, bet, no problem. But at this point again, I am a un, I mean, I am a virgin when it comes to certain stuff. So it's just like, ooh, and I didn't know too much about douching like I do now. I mean, you know, actually clean yourself. Cause but I took a shower. Like I didn't like clean myself. I just took a shower, right? But I know about douching stuff like that. I'm like, oh fuck, like he about to go in me. It's tight. Uh, you know what I'm saying, bitch? But I was like, girl, let me just trust my body, right? But was I wrong? So, so I decided to, um, 
So I decided to, I said, okay, whatever, like that. But she's, he pissed him. And again, y'all, don't let nobody use lotion, Vaseline. I'm telling you because this is true. Don't let nobody use lotion, Vaseline, spit, none of that shit, bitch. If they do not have lube and a condom, girl, leave it, leave it alone. But do what you want, girl. I'm not, I'm not, because bitch always makes time for good story time. So it's hot. Um, I always make, I would, you know, shit like that always makes, makes a good story at times or whatever. But, um, but yeah, so he used spit. <sighs> and he spit on it, girl. He got it all, I guess, lubed up and proceeded to stick it in. And again, now mind you, baby, again, he's big and he's thick. So I'm just like, oh, fuck. Bitch is about to hurt. Breathe in. So I breathe in. And he sticks it in, and I breathe out, right? <laughs> and girl, when I tell you, bitch, no shade, mama was out here shaking, bitch. She stuck it in. And of course, he is unprofessional. I mean, unprofessional. He is not, what you probably say, a man of sex, right? Like, I'm pretty sure he fucked people. But, you know, he fucking like a goddamn rabbit with this big ass dick, and it hurt, right? And I'm like, oh, bitch, I can take it. You know what I'm saying? Like, this bitch mama is a punk. So I'm sitting there taking it for a little while. I'm sitting there taking it for a little while. And next thing you know, girl, I start smelling something. So I said, what's that fucking smell? And I started hurting. So I was like, you know what? Let me just, I said, oh, baby, let, you know. I tried to play it off. Like, I said, oh, let me let me go ahead and, 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 suck, and suck that nut down. Suck, suck that out, right? And he said, okay, cool. So he pulled it out, boom, boom. Girl, tell me why. <laughs> Tell me why. I kid you not. And this is probably personal as fuck, but it is what it is. It's content. Who gives a fuck? We all have human. We all have, especially if you're in the LGBTQ plus community, honey, you know somebody or you've been through this yourself. I, he pulls out and there's a little residue or something on his penis. Now, back in my head, I'm like, oh, what the fuck? I, this man did. Like, why Why would he keep going? And like that, I'm like, bitch, is he into, not know what that is, but you know, you know, stuff play. And I'm just like, yo, whatever. And like, he kept, I was like, but you don't keep on going. So I, I looked at him. Mm -mm. So I was like, something going on. And then I was like, and bitch, on, there was boo boo on the thing. I'm just like, oh, no. And I, at this point, I'm embarrassed. I'm like, girl, I thought I knew my body. <laughs> you thought, I thought I knew my body and I don't, but whatever. And, um, and yeah. And girl, I painted his dangling, honey. Now, girls, and one of the girls that I told, I painted the dick, girl. I painted the town, honey. I painted the town, girl. And he, but then my dad said he wasn't even phased about it. I'm just like, you don't see this on, on your thing? I'm in, like, again, I'm embarrassed. I'm like, what the fuck? I'm, I'm just like, oh. you know, but apparently he, he didn't he didn't care. I said, like, okay, well, cool. So I wiped it off, girl. I went to the restaurant, I got something, I wiped it off, and we continue to do it, right? No more aspects, so I just talked him off till he came, right? And after that, bitch, you know, like like all the DL niggas do, bitch, you, you know, you act like you don't know, bitch, all right, cool, you know the way out, bye, right, bam. So then, um, so yeah, yeah, it just went on and went on and went on. You know, like we was fucking throughout the summer, different occasions, nothing really changed, um, really. He was he was fucking like fucking like that, but this time, well, other times, I, I looked up for information so I know I was prepared, bro, right? So let's talk about now about how um, he got exposed. <laughs> so let's talk about how he got exposed. So um, during that summer, nothing really happened. I didn't really say nothing. Now this was messy as it was his messy ass twins. Um, one's gonna be Queso and the other one's gonna be Cassidy, right? So Queso and Cassidy was the messy ass boy twins, the dark skin boy twins. I don't think they was jealous of me to be honest with you, girl, but it is what it is. Um, which, which they, they, they just regular ass Bush Queens girl now, girl. But okay, or they were straight. Either way, go. They something. Okay, they something. They're something. They're something. So, um, so yeah. So I, my thing is that. So I told. I didn't tell nobody at, the, at, at like at tenth grade. I didn't really tell nobody. But I, you know, I, I told my close friends, and at the time, although they was close friends of mine, so I told them. <laughs> 
So I told them, uh, I was like, hey, yeah, you know what I'm saying? I tried to record it. That's the funny part. I tried to record it and like make a video, you know what I'm saying? So just kept saying, like, stupid or dumb. I can have it on record. Like, no, I think you was all in the that, which was stupid. And, and, and I wouldn't advise a girl to do that shit because you never know people going through. So but anyway. So he was like, uh, so I tried to record this, but I told him now. I was like, oh yeah, I'm trying to, I, I'm gonna try to record it, you know, cause you know, they didn't believe me. I was like, okay, I'm gonna try to record it, bitch. So I record it, but it didn't work out. I deleted it. I was like, no, this shit's stupid. I'm gonna just do this. And shit. I told them and probably my, like some other girls and that shit blew up, bitch. I mean, girl, everybody was talking. And it was so funny cause at this time too, a lot of boys at school was getting exposed. And but I'm going to, that's on the story time, but it, it that's a horrible story time. Um, a lot of dudes in my school was getting exposed. And of course, his name came up because it was like, oh, bitch, but you know, da, 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 da. I'm just like, well, damn, like, I, I fucked up. And then it was so funny because I got a text from him talking about, oh, you was telling people? I'm like, no. I say, and I try to act dumb, bitch. Like, I don't know nothing. I'm like, no, I didn't tell nobody. Are you telling people? Like, are you recording stuff? He's like, no. I was like, okay, cool. So I, I, I had to sex tape out. But of course, it wasn't really a sex. You know, people text you and they run with it, girl. But because apparently, this whole ass sex tape, girl, I was a new Kim Kardashian, honey, uh, of, of Kim Sunny Side High School. But whatever. So, um, so yeah. So I had, um, so I did that and that shit, you know, whatever, that, that blew up in my face. And we, and we, of course, we, we, we stopped fucking. We, like, we fucked one last time. I want to say last year. Yeah, I think last year, 2019, we fucked one last time. Because he was he was on the side of his hand like that. And it was all right, but it wasn't, I just, yeah, I wasn't 19, girl. I was young and I was like 2018. In my long story short, I was still being young, dumb, and I fucked him again. And that was the last fuck we ever did. And I don't have concert with him no more now. But yeah, that's pretty much the story. I'm sorry if it's not juicy, juicy, but it's. I mean, I have juicy earth stories, and I can go more details about that. But that's that's pretty much it. Um, but yeah, it's just, and that was, and, and that's just pretty much that on that. I mean, I'm fucking niggas. You know what I'm saying, bitch? I'm giving y'all all types of teas, bitch. But here, yeah, nothing really happened. Nothing really. He tried to charge up me. Now he was trying to fight me, per se. But that shit didn't work the fuck out, whole cause. Who? You know what I'm saying, bitch? I'm 5'10". I was a big girl back then, too. So, who trying to girl? And he was about my height, probably 6'1". But he he really was like 6'1". But anyway, who was trying to girl? Nobody. Thank you. So, um, but yeah, that was pretty much it. He didn't really, and nothing really came after that. Like, we just, we, we kind of, of course, grew apart, you know, stuff like that. Of course, after you get exposed, you won't fuck the same people that exposed you. So, but that's pretty much it for this story time. I hope y'all was entertained. That's the best I can do right now. But I do have more short times coming. More videos coming for y'all. You know, all, all, all the other good shit. Y'all know the fucking vibes. Um, shout out to, 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 to Kitten. She probably won't even, even see this girl. But if you, if, if you into the Vogue scene, or at least on Instagram like I am, you know, you know who Kitten Guns is. Shout out to her, girl. Y'all know the fucking vibes. But yeah, and that's pretty much it. I will talk to y'all in the next one.